Well, NASA releases more images taken by the most powerful space telescope ever, the James Webb Space Telescope. Fox 2 meteorologist Angela Huddy is live outside the planetarium at the St. Louis Science Center with more on the pictures of space that everyone's talking about. Angela. They really are everywhere, Mandy and Vic, and they are fascinatingly beautiful. And scientists around the world cannot wait to use these deep space images to really figure out what's the future of space exploration. Will Snyder is the manager of the McDonald Planetarium at the St. Louis Science Center. He's also an astrophysicist. There's so much out there in the universe that there's always something new to learn, and that's what I love about it. Right now, there is a whole lot new to learn. NASA has released the first images from its brand new James Webb Space Telescope. He says the science community has been waiting decades for images like these. What I really love about the images they picked today is that they give a good taste of really what this telescope will be capable of. We were able to see galaxies, nebulae, atmospheres of planets, and we've been able to look back to the almost very beginning of the universe as we think of it. Snyder explains that while the Hubble Space Telescope has revolutionized the way we see the universe, it mostly uses visible light. Webb uses the infrared spectrum to see things in greater detail than ever before. The fact that we can see the infrared light coming from different stars, area around black holes and merging galaxies really give us a much fuller picture than what we can see with just visible light. Webb is the world's largest and most powerful space telescope. It launched in December and reached its lookout point 1 million miles from Earth in January. Scientists say these images and ones that will follow will change our understanding of the universe. It allows us to start to answer questions that before we didn't even know to ask. With each of these pictures that come back, we're the first people to get these looks at things that no one has ever seen before. And I think that's just really an amazing concept that without ever leaving the Earth, we all are exploring space together. And if you're looking at these Webb Telescope pictures and you have questions, the planetarium is, of course, a wonderful research, uh, resource. Excuse me. In all their shows going forward, they're going to have these Webb Telescope images so you can learn more there. And this Saturday, they are going to have NASA Solar System Ambassadors here at the planetarium, also available to answer your questions. Reporting live outside of the planetarium in Forest Park, I'm meteorologist Angela Huddy, Fox 2 News.